Hey guys, it's Mana here, and I decided that I wanted to play Portal 2 for you guys. I've played the game before, I've played it on console, which is why I'm excited that, so I'm told, the second one has the console ab controller ability. So, hoping that's right, because it's gonna stink if I have to play this game with a mouse pad again. Let me, options, controller, enabled, awesome. Awesome. So, we're gonna jump in. Whoa, not cooperative, because I don't have anyone to play with. Forever alone. Um, so we'll just jump right in and see, see how much I remember of this game and see how bad I am at it. That's probably all I need. Good morning. You have been in suspension for 50 days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. So roughly every two buzzer. months? When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Whoa. Good. Forgot which stick did what. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Good. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. Really? There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. This is art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, Look stare at the, at the art. You should now feel mentally reinvigorated. If you just start staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. Okay. Now, please return to your bed. I had to look at my controls to see which one was X. It's been, that's how long it's been since I've played. Good morning. You have been in suspension for... Nine, 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 nine. This courtesy call Hello? Anyone in there? Subject should vacate the enrichment Hello? immediately. Ha! Ah! Yeah. Oh, God. You look... Um, good. Looking good, actually. Are you okay? Are, are you... Don't... Answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it. Slow. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. It's all the same. Prepare. It's all fine. All right. Don't move. I'm going to get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. To what? There's really not much to hang on to. That's like bolted down. And there's that light. Whoa. I'm suddenly floating. Oh, God. Oh, down there. Can you hear me? Yeah. Hello? Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although, if you, do, if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling, because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying? You know, That's people all, with brain damage don't feel any much sense? of just anything, just say yes. to my knowledge. Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you just you just jumped. But never mind. Say apple. Apple. Okay, you know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. <laughs> yeah, that's close enough. All reactor core safeguards are now non-functional. Please prepare for reactor core meltdown. Oh, that sounds like fun. Oh, Jesus. Okay, look. I okay, wasn't let him know that side you. of the room. I'm in pretty hot water here. How are you doing down there? You still holding on? Yeah, but uh, the half the room's gone. Ran out. So, of course, the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Hold Whoa. on, this is a bit tricky. And, of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Why should I be kept informed, you know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of? Why? It's close. Can you see? Am I going to make it through? But not enough space. I, um... Uh, just, no. just got to get through here. Yeah, no. I, I just got to concentrate. Now, and how many of the test subjects have you seen? When the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables. I mean, I'm not quite a vegetable. I hit that one. But you did more than hit that honey. You, uh... Okay, you're listen, sending it into oblivion. Get story straight, all right? If anyone asks, and no one's going to ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, 
Tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive. All right? Not dead. OK, almost there. Are they dead? On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. Um, it says docking station down. Good news. That is not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. I may be a vegetable, but even I can tell Almost the difference there. between... Remember, you're looking for a gun yeah. that makes holes. Not okay. bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on this time. Bloop. I just like... I'm just going to jump. There we go. Oh, wake up call. To be cool. honest, you are probably in no fit state to run this. Wait! Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. Oh, wait. I just noticed something. Subtitles. Uh, there it is. Full captions. Subtitles only. Done. We okay. are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance beyond our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. The portal will open and emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. Whoa, okay, I am through. Okay. That's fun. Jungle definitely took over. And button based testing remains an important tool for science, even in a dire emergency. If cube and button based testing caused this emergency, don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. Please note the incandescent particle Whoa, field across the exit. This aperture only. science material emancipation grill will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. Let me. There we go. Subtitles only. I don't need full closed captioning. Well. If you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. Well, that doesn't sound good. Whoa, Jesus. I mean, this one looks oddly familiar, except, um, looks oddly familiar, except it's not timed this time. Ha ha. Good. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Well, that's Before safe. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, Please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will revive you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of animal king, sentient cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to reason. Okay. I get the feeling that an animal king would have more ability to listen hey, to reason than hi there should be a, a portal device on that podium over there i can't see it though maybe it fell off oh. Whee! Hello? well i'm glad that didn't kill me can you see the portal gun 
No, but there's these arrows pointing this way. Can you hear me splashing? And assuming I can locate your body, I will bury you. No, that's not portable. Portable. Oh, hi. There's a ramp right here. <laughs> Duh. But yes, in the event that an animal takes over, I'm pretty sure they'll have more ability to listen to reason than humans do. Because no matter what, humans are right. We have an issue with admitting we're wrong. Whoa! I can walk, I swear! Some emergency testing Whoa. may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robots to share. Good. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. When, when uh, society is rebuilt, I take it? This next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed in three, two, one. This looks oddly familiar, doesn't it? Doesn't it? Oh, I guess I have to... Oh, okay, no, that's not what I wanted to do. But seriously, that camera, it's got weight to it, just like it did in the first game. Should do the thing with the stuff. Whee! Okay. Okay, okay. That almost sounds like someone screaming, doesn't it? Whoa. Hi. You know what? Just... yeah. Right there. Not too difficult. Great work. Even for a vegetable. Because this message is pre-recorded, any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please disregard any undeserved compliments. Huh. <laughs> well, that didn't do me. Oh, well, I guess that did, though. Ooh, rat man. It's over here. That's where they want me to go. But I'm gonna go here. Because... These are interesting. Well, that, that's not very... Oh, hi! Unreason. Okay, well, if I was good at math... Oh, okay. Well... Can I go? No, I don't think I can go there. Anything good? Back here? No? Nothing? Okay. I'll keep going. I guess I'll just keep progressing. If the enrichment center is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or other objects from space, please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. Whee! That probably was one of the fewer safer things I've done. What did I do? What did I activate? Oh, I activated stairs. Okay, so... I need... Ah, uh, there you are, Lick Cube. So I need that there. But I need to get up there. Oh, wait. 
There's a button here. Good, good, good. Awesome sauce. You. Awesome. Okay, so then we go up here. Hmm. Oh! If I get another one, will it destroy this one? Yes, yes it will. Got it. Okay, so. What do these do? Okay, well, that answers that question. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Long fall boots. I love my long fall boots. I would love to have a pair of long fall boots in real life. Functional or not, I mean, they're cute. Well done. The enrichment center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you are not alone. All temperature science personality constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic, low-power environments of as few as 1.1 volts. Good to know. You have nothing to say? Oh, all right. Well, in that case, I'm out of time for today, but I'm very excited to be playing this game again. It is so much fun. It's one of my favorites. Um, yeah, but I will be logging off now. I'll see you guys later. And remember to do something nice for strangers today. You may just save a life. Bye.